Okay, guys, so here's the thing. Law enforcement is having a horrible time, okay? When these auditors come through, these auditors are exposing these police officers, and that's a great thing, right? So, guys, let's reach 15,000 subscribers. We need to reach 15,000 subscribers. And also, consider liking the video. It helps boost the channel and the algorithm, guys. If you're not liking it, what's the point, right? If you really enjoyed this video, consider liking it because it really helps the channel grow. And let's reach 15,000 subscribers. All right, guys, I'll be adding additional commentary and narration under fair use, adding my commentary, criticism, and new information to this video, making this video educational and transformative in nature while also giving the creator the original credit that they deserve. Check out Coley Burke Audits. I'll put the link to his channel in the description. He does very good work on dealing with law enforcement. All original links in the description. I'm out, guys. Peace, and yeah, have a wonderful day. Bye-bye. And enjoy. Place. This how, is this, how is this a private place? Look at, look at where we are. Look, look, look. Just so the camera can pick it up, yeah? So if it... No, no, no. You're talking nonsense, mate. You're talking rubbish. And there you are, mate. You're trying to flex jurisdiction. Let's let's just let's just pack it in. Yes, you are. I will carry on filming. No, I'm not going to step there. So we've got... So we've got... So section... So we've got section 50. And now we're talking about private land. What's next? What's next? What's next? So I'm correcting what I'm telling you. No. You're just flexing unnecessarily. Yes, you are. You're not an issue to me. One seven nine. All right, I'm not an issue. No worries. You're not an issue to me. Good. I have no reason to flex to you. Good. You are not that much of an issue. Good. I'm then, saying, then there should be no me. reason. There should, there should be no. The there should be no. Um, there should be no concerns about me filming. Then, if that's the case. Well, generally there is concerns. Well, you just said that I'm not an issue to you. You're not an issue for me to flex. That means Hello. I'm not bothered by you. You're not being tired of my okay? Okay. Um, it's not about me. It's about you. It's about your ego, not about mine. It's not about, not about your. Yeah, of course your it is. Your ego needs to be approved and, and swept and fucking stroked because you're standing. Did you just swear? Because yeah, I did just swear. So I'm you not just in a public place. Just, of course you're in a public place. You just committed a section five. I'm not in a public hold place. On, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Dean, bro. This is pack it in, mate. Pack it in, mate. Pack it in, mate. Mate, pack it in right now. Don't swear again. You are, we're all in a public place. This is all public. Private. This is all public. This is all publicly accessible. Show me, show me where the uh, boundary is that denotes public Don't and private. No. <laughs> Double Don't yellow line doesn't line. denote private property. Dean, mate, you're Don't digging yourself a hole. You're digging yourself a hole. You just swore. You started with section 50. Then you're saying yeah. private property. Even if this was private property, it's a civil matter. This is publicly yeah, accessible. This isn't private property anyway. This is private mate, matter. This is mate, this is not being good. Mate, this ain't good. Okay. Why are you swearing? Can I swear? Can I use the F word? You can swear if you want, sir. So I can say. Always film the police. Get back to the video. Yeah, no, I feel good, yeah. And you did swear in a public place. Private. This ain't private, mate. No, it's not. You're making yourself look, you're making yourself look ridiculous. Just go, just go back inside, mate. All right. Always film the police, especially in the United States, because it is your. I don't have to take a pinch of nothing. I don't have to take any advice from any of you. I'm in a public place filming, which is lawful. And I know. And you've tried to threaten me. Yeah, you have. Yes, you have. You haven't educated me. I'm educating you right now. Go on. With you standing so close to the entrance. I'm not obstructing you, am I? No, but you need to listen. With you standing so close to an entrance filming. That, that poses security questions for us, okay? There are people who wish to do the police harm. Okay, I'm not one of those. Okay, but we don't know that, do we? Well, you, you have to go based on what you do know. You haven't identified yourself. So I don't need to. You as an unknown risk, so we don't know Why am I a risk? This is a, this is a camera. Because you're an unknown risk. Common sense Based on what? If an old old so granny was filming here, would she be an unknown risk? You're, you're not letting me finish, so that I can't, you can't understand my point. Okay. By you standing here, common sense would dictate but that poses a security risk. Why? Is the building safety. not secure? Like, you so lot are armed, like you've got here, a taser. Like, what sort of security risk is it? standing here constantly, filming cars coming in and out. Right marked, doors, marked open, cars, right marked right cars that are paid for by the taxpayer. I've got every right to film them. Right next to where a gate opens in and out. Like I said, you're an unknown risk. You've got a bad, we don't know what you've got on you. You could run All right, you well, could have something on well, you that we don't know. Yeah, well, so that's why I mean, there's lots of members of the public that have stuff on them that they that you don't know. I know, but they're not 
Are oh, they all unknown risks like, as well? Yeah, yeah well, I can be everyone's here. Everyone's an unknown risk. Everyone's an unknown risk. We don't live in a police state where everyone's an unknown risk and you're constantly doing surveillance. What sort of bra you lot have been brainwashed or something? I'm just a member of the public. Chill out. We're not all unknown risks. What, what are they teaching you in training? Unknown risk. Is this a police state? Do you have to spy on each other? All like, we all have to like snitch on each other. What's going on here? Like, what is going on here? We have to manage risks. So we always have to manage risks. That's why we have to do. Hey, you lot unknown are. Risk and so no. Anything that we don't know is unknown to us, so we have to treat it with an element of caution. So, is it just me, or do they look related, like they're brothers and sisters? Am I wrong to think that? Get back to the video. Yo. Would you identify yourself? Yeah, I'm PC Cook. Okay. One six five four. Sure. Yeah, and I'm, I'm just talking to you like I would to anybody else. All right. And that's that's the point I'm trying to impress to you today, sir. That's all. Okay. Now what? Well, like my colleague said, because we don't know you, we don't know the risk, we are going to just ask you to move on to the public point. <laughs> this is public here. I apps guarantee you 100% this is public here. But with your proxy and even if it was private, this is publicly accessible. Look, 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 look. Just, just, for some, just for some context, right? He's saying this yellow line denotes where it's public, where it's private. So how, how could this possibly be private property? Even let's say hypothetically it was private property, yeah? Who owns this property? Does, does the Met Police own this property or would they hypothetically the lease the property? Owns this property. It's no, they don't. Us by okay, right. So who so pays for the council? How's, 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 the, how's the council funded? I'm pretty sure this is leased anyway. I'm pretty sure the Met don't own this. This was gifted to us. So you know that for a fact, do you? Well, you got flowers on your radio. Why not? That's so so asking why. If you went into a shop and they had a counter with no barriers either side, you would know that yeah, behind, that shop's, yeah, that shop's that not, that shop's not paid for by the taxpayer. So the behind that kiosk area, even though you can access it, is an inaccessible point. That's another common sense approach. So you can see that from there to here, and then this bit here, common sense would dictate that this is not a public part of the domain. Yeah? Okay, well this is all paid for by tax money, so... You have to un you understand why we're talking. You understand how you understand how like fiscal fiscal policy works. So the government tax, and then okay. they spend on public services, and this is that. Does that make sense? Yes, that makes sense. Yeah, so, so it's a, it's a fiscal policy. It's the economic policy, right? So it dictates how spending and taxation works. Okay, I, I, yeah. I, I, I'm not here for a lesson. I'm just trying to talk All to you. Right. And I'm just trying to explain a, to a, you as a person, yeah. from a person to a person, why we are managing the risk of somebody standing by the entrance that's constantly used to a police station. Okay, have I satisfied that I'm not a risk? Well, no. All right, well, how are you going to satisfy well. it then? Well, we're just... We're just remember, everything I'm doing right now is perfectly legal, so... Just remember that. And it's not antisocial. Well, you... But why did you backpedal on that? I didn't backpedal. Yeah, you did. You but then why are you not nicking me under section 50 then? But on, on... Besides what's going on in the video, this lady officer looks pretty good, though. I, I would definitely ask her out on a date if I was there, but I'm not there, so... Okay. I'm trying to approach you with common sense. I don't like to unnecessarily criminalise people. Oh, oh, thank you. Good, so, good. Me and my colleague have tried to appeal to your common sense nature, but clearly. Good. I'm happy that you're not. I'm happy that you're not criminalising people. That's good. You know of any officers doing stuff like that? Well, no, any officers yeah. Unnecessary yeah. 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 Never heard of that. Right. Good. Good. Well, how you just, you know you swore in a public place as well. I didn't swear. In a public yeah, you did. Place, yeah. I did not. And if that has offended you, then I do apologise. But I did not swear in a public place. You did. You said the f word. I got it on camera. I'm not, I swore, but I'm not in a public place. <laughs> All right. If you if you say so. Okay. Go. Are we done. Yeah, you go back. You're done. All right. You're dismissed. You're dismissed. Go away. Yeah, yeah dismissed. Muppet. Swearing in public. Section fifty. Private property. Yeah, you're a Muppet, mate. Shut up. I really, guys, hope you are enjoying this video. Consider liking, subscribing, and sharing, guys. Let's reach 15,000 subscribers. The fact is this, guys. Police in the, in the United Kingdom cannot be trusted. I don't know what it is about these officers, but they like to go hands-on. That's one of the things that they like to do. Now, I'm about to fast-forward to this video because there's more that goes on towards the end. But the fact is this, the cops cannot be trusted. Always film the police. Get back to the video and enjoy. <coughs> bye bye now. Folds. Big old place.
<laughs> Hello. Hello, you okay? Yeah, are you? I'm not too bad. What are we filming for? Because I want to. Did you want to? Yeah. Yeah, this one's going to get troublesome. I already know what's going to go down. Look at No particular reason, just because this is what I've chosen to do today. Would you mind identifying, please? Peace, Dean. Okay. Code number 17920. And yourself? Okay. Why are you lot all coming out like this? You're making me feel nervous. Because like. when people start filming as a of our police station, it tends to alert red flags. Okay? For what reason? For, mainly for terrorism. I'm not saying you are. Okay. Okay. But mainly because... Majority of people come around, they like to film our cars, know what our registrations are, know right. what police officers look like. What? Okay. No obviously just for getting in and out of the building safe and secure them. So that in that way they can potentially perform a terrorist attack, <coughs> okay, and have it all on recording. So that's why we come down and we like to check to make sure why they are. So you asked me to identify myself. Yeah, I'm not gonna identify, identify no. Myself, no. Why is that? I'm not required to, I'm not committing any offence. You're not required to because you're not committing any offence. Yeah, absolutely. However, you are in a public place. Absolutely, okay? exactly. So under Section 50 of the Police Reform Act, okay. you could be required to identify yourself with name and address or you could be arrested. Okay? If what if I'm believed to be antisocial? Anti so am I manner. behaving antisocially? Filming outside the police Does it not constitute antisocial behaviour? No. Is that the route we're going to go down? I'm not going to give you my name. I'm not going to give you my name. I wouldn't, I wouldn't suggest using the Section 50 power. You would have to prove that I'm behaving antisocially. Causing members of the public you, harassment, you alarm, and to to okay. So how is my behaviour? You're filming, and in fact, you're standing outside. There's <coughs> a member of the public to walk past and feel completely distressed by the fact that you. How would they feel the distressed time. by that? Am I engaging anyone else? I'm because just here fact filming you. you walk past, since uh, what are we, what are we doing? Then? Am I, are you going to nick me now? Are you? Well, I'm going to ask you to move on, sir. I'm not going to move on. I'm in a public place. He. Check out Cully Regardets. All original links in the description add additional commentary and narration under fair use. And in my commentary, criticism, and new information to this video, making this video educational and transformative in nature.